Hello everyone, welcome to Starlight Reality Channel. Today we bring you an influential figure who has caught the attention of many in the world of sports and entertainment, Shannon Sharp. Thank you for subscribing to our channel. As Shannon Sharp continues to inspire and entertain millions with his infectious enthusiasm and charismatic personality, he remains a role model for aspiring athletes and a testament to the power of hard work, determination, and a genuine love for the game. Let's get to know him. Shannon Sharp Lifestyle and Net Worth Shannon Sharp, born June 26, 1968, is an American former football tight end who played 14 seasons in the National Football League, NFL, primarily with the Denver Broncos. Regarded as one of the greatest tight ends of all time, he ranks third in tight end receptions, receiving yards, and receiving touchdowns. He was also the first NFL tight end to amass over 10,000 receiving yards. He was inducted to the Pro Football Hall of Fame in 2011. Sharp played college football for the Savannah State Tigers and was selected by the Broncos in the seventh round of the 1990 NFL Draft. During his 12 non-consecutive seasons with Denver, he was selected to seven consecutive Pro Bowls and four first-team All-Pros, and won two consecutive Super Bowl titles. In between his Broncos tenures, Sharp was a member of Baltimore Ravens for two seasons, with whom he received an eighth Pro Bowl selection and won a third Super Bowl title. Sharp retired as the NFL leader in receptions, receiving yards, and receiving touchdowns by a tight end. Following his retirement, Sharp appeared as an analyst for the NFL Today on CBS Sports and co-hosted Skip and Shannon. Undisputed on Fox Sports 1 with Skip Bayless from 2016 to 2023. Shannon Sharp has a net worth of approximately 14 to 15 million dollars. He is 6 feet 2 inches tall, which is equivalent to 1.88 meters tall. That being said let's get some popcorns. Fascinating points about Shannon Sharp. His favorite color is blue, symbolizing trust, loyalty, and depth. Shannon believes that blue represents his unwavering dedication to his craft and his ability to connect with his audience on a profound level. One of Shannon's fondest childhood memories is playing football with his siblings and friends in their neighborhood. They would spend countless hours on the field, honing their skills and fostering a sense of camaraderie. This childhood experience instilled in Shannon a passion for the game, which eventually led him to a successful career in the NFL. Shannon's zodiac sign is Cancer, which is known for its emotional depth, intuition, and protective nature. As a Cancer, Shannon possesses a strong sense of empathy and uses his platform to advocate for social causes close to his heart. Shannon Sharp Early Life and Education Sharp, the younger brother of former NFL star wide receiver Sterling Sharp, grew up in Glenville, Georgia where he was an All-State player in three sports at Glenville High School. He once joked, we were so poor, a robber once broke into our house and we ended up robbing the robber. He commented, I was a terrible student. I didn't graduate magna cum laude, I graduated, thank you, laude. At Savannah State University, he played football and basketball, and also competed in track and field. In track, he competed in jumping and throwing events. Sharp was a three-time All-Southern Intercollegiate Athletic Conference selection from 1987 to 1989 and the SIAC Player of the Year in 1987. He was also selected as a Kodak Division II All-American in 1989. He led the Tigers football team to their best records in the program's history, 7-3 in 1988 and 8-1 in 1989. As a senior, Sharp caught 61 passes for 1,312 yards and 18 touchdowns, including three games with more than 200 yards. Sharp finished his college career with 192 receptions for 3,744 yards and 40 touchdowns. He was inducted into the Division II Football Hall of Fame in 2009, Savannah State's Athletic Hall of Fame in 2010, and the Black College Football Hall of Fame in 2013. Professional Career Despite his stellar college career, Sharp was not considered a highly rated prospect in the 1990 NFL Draft. 
In addition to playing Division II college football, Sharp's size, 6 feet 2 inches, 230 pounds, was considered too large for a receiver and too small for a tight end. He was eventually selected in the seventh round with the 192nd pick by the Denver Broncos. After two mediocre seasons as a receiver in which he caught just 29 passes, Denver converted him to a tight end. This quickly paid off, as Sharp caught 53 passes in his third season. He remained with Denver until 1999, winning two championship rings at Super Bowl 32 and Super Bowl 33 in the process. After the 1997 season championship, his first, he appeared on General Mills Wheaties boxes with four other Broncos. After a two-year stint with the Baltimore Ravens, where he won another championship ring at Super Bowl 35, he returned to the Broncos. He played there until 2003. From there, he retired to become an NFL analyst for CBS. In the Ravens' 2000 AFC title game against the Oakland Raiders, he caught a short pass on third down and 18 from his own four-yard line and took it 96 yards for a touchdown, the only touchdown the Ravens scored, en route to a 16-3 Ravens win. As of 2024, this remains the Ravens' longest offensive play in team history. Sharp also caught a 50-plus yard pass in each of their other two playoff games. He finished his 14-year career with 815 receptions for 10,060 yards and 62 touchdowns in 203 games. Shannon Sharp Post-Playing Career Sharp was a commentator for the CBS Sports pregame show The NFL Today, including the Sprint Halftime Report and the Subway Postgame Show, replacing Deion Sanders and co-hosting with James Brown, formerly with Fox NFL Sunday former NFL quarterbacks Dan Marino and Boomer Esiason, as well as former coach Bill Cowher. In the 2004 NFL regular season, Sharp defeated Marino and Esiason in the pick-m game of the NFL today with a 53-21 record. On February 18, 2014, it was announced that Sharp, along with Dan Marino, were being relieved of their duties as on-air commentators on the NFL Today and were being replaced by Tony Gonzalez and Bart Scott. In 2013, Sharp became a columnist and spokesperson for Fitness RX for Men magazine and appeared on their September 2013 cover. Sharp has hosted Sirius NFL Radio's opening drive morning program, alongside Bob Papa. On November 28, 2010, Sharp was nominated as a semi-finalist for induction into the 2011 Pro Football Hall of Fame, along with Art Modell and 24 others, among them Jerome Bettis, Roger Craig, Marshall Falk, and Deion Sanders. Subsequently, on February 6, 2011, Shannon Sharp was inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame. After his retirement, Sharp has been a social media staple, going viral for his antics and sports commentary. He is also notably a huge supporter of NBA player LeBron James, referring to him as the greatest basketball player in NBA history. He also appeared on the American Dad episode, The Scarlet Getter, portraying himself. Sharp joined Skip Bayless in FS1 sports debate show Skip and Shannon, Undisputed which premiered on September 6, 2016. Sharp also has a podcast called Club Shay Shay. The episode of Club Shay Shay featuring Bubba Wallace was selected by the Apple Podcasts editorial team on their Apple Podcasts Best of 2021 list. On May 31, 2023, it was announced that Sharp would soon leave Undisputed after reaching a buyout agreement with Fox Sports. On June 13, Sharp co-hosted his last episode of Undisputed. On August 23, 2023, it was announced that Sharp and his Club Shay Shay podcast would join The Volume, a digital podcast network founded by Colin Cowherd under a multi-year deal. On August 24, 2023, it was announced on social media that Sharp would join First Take, starting September 4, 2023, every Monday and Tuesday during the 2023 NFL season. Thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe to our channel for such amazing content.